What's up everybody, Nyan here. Welcome back to the channel. Uh, as many of you guys know, I currently drive a 2020 Crosstrek and I actually got this Crosstrek back in 20 of 2019, 2019, 2019, November 2019. And so I've had it well over a year now and um, I currently run the stock halogen lights. So I was gonna eventually upgrade to uh, some LED lights uh, because the stock headlights weren't doing it for me, especially um, when I'm off-roading. I do fairly light off-roading um, when I go rock climbing, so um, so I wanted to find a better solution uh, outside of just having the ditch lights that I already have installed. So um, I knew I wanted to eventually get LED lights, and uh, I was fortunate enough to where Oxido had reached out to me and sent me a pair of LED headlights to test on the 2020 Crosstrek. So. Uh, without further ado, let's go ahead and open the box, see what's in it, and go ahead and install it on the cross trek. Okay. Yeah. Zip ties and a Allen product manual and the two lights. Here we go. Alright, so my first impressions of the Oxito LED lights right out the box, the build quality of the product is extremely solid. It doesn't feel cheap or flimsy or it feels like it breaks or bends easily. So um, I would have to give this one to Oxito for the build quality on this one. And as you can see here, there's a built-in fan just so that the uh, LED doesn't overheat over time. And of course the Oxito uh, logo on the ballast here and then the connecting piece that connects to the car. All right, now it's time for the install. First, you're gonna wanna take off the trim, so go ahead and pull out the little nubs that keep the trim in. And then go ahead and pull off the channel that connects to the air intake, as well as the trim. Next, you want to unplug the wire from the halogen lights. Once completed, go ahead and turn the halogen light clockwise and carefully pull it out. And then carefully insert the Oxito LED light. Now, the thing about LED lights, you want to make sure that the chip faces left and right. So 3 o'clock and 9 o'clock. And repeat the same for the other side. Unplug. Turn the old halogen light out. Go ahead and pull it out. and insert the Oxito LED light. And plug it right back in. Now you're done. Okay, so we just finished installing it. I just turned them on and we are testing uh, these lights and see if they both work and they look like they both Turn on. So, um, first impression so far, uh, as you can probably tell, these lights are a little bit more whiter, brighter white. Um, the halogen lights were kind of like a little bit uh, warmer, yellowy. Um, but here, you can see already in the garage, you're getting a solid beam there. That just, just that nice line right here. Um, that's pretty freaking good. Um, so. I'm actually going to be headed to the gym in a little bit, so I want to be able to test this because I normally stay at the gym for a good couple hours, and by the time I leave, it's already dark. So uh, that'll give me enough time to actually test these lights and see how they look and how they do well on a dark road. All right, in this example, you can see in this stock lights, the the light is a little bit a uh, little bit more subdued. It's not so clear. It's pretty dim as I'm pulling out here of the uh, the driveway and then this is with the Oxito LED lights uh, much more pronounced much brighter hotter beam uh, I could even see the front door of this house right here right across the uh, the street here very clear low beam 
High beam. Low beam. High beam. Headlights on. So as you can see, it's like significantly brighter. The, uh, it's more of a beam, it's a hotter center. As I turn onto the street uh, with halogen lights, I can not really see the house at the end, but with the Oxito LED lights, I could see my neighbor's garage uh, as clear as day. Um, driving down the street so it is mind-blowing how bright the oxito lights are All right, so as you can see, the Oxido lights made a huge difference on the Crosstrek in comparison to the halogen lights, on uh, the stock halogen lights. Um, the stock halogen lights were a little too warm for me in color, the yellow color, but the light dispersion was a little bit short too as well. It was kind of weak there. Whereas like the Oxido LED lights uh, had a much more uh, brighter in terms of uh, the white color, so uh, it was much more whiter. Um, this the spread was also wide, wider, um, but the beam was so strong too that it made for a farther throw in terms of the light so I could see farther at distance. So it made me feel more confident to drive at night in the darker parts of the neighborhood. Um, and who knows, maybe I'll be able to, to record some footage uh, out on some off-road areas where I'd like to go rock climbing. So, um, or on the long stretches of road where there's like absolutely no light, especially off the 395. So. Um, so yeah, so uh, I cannot highly recommend Oxito enough. Uh, big shout out to Oxito for sending me uh, these headlights uh, to test. Uh, I think these look amazing on the Crosstrek. So if you have a Crosstrek, go get yourself an Oxito LED light or, or any other lights that they provide. Uh, I will provide a link in the description below. And if you want a, a discount, a little discount, go ahead and use the affiliate link as well. This code I'll use is CGK Milano. So be sure to use that code when purchasing your Oxito LED lights. Uh, and if you have any other questions or if you like anything that you saw today, be sure to hit that like and subscribe button, leave comments below, and I will address any other questions that you may have in the next video. See you on the next one.